don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. Ew. <laughs> Spiders. Now there's gonna be dogs in the hallway. Or not in the hallway, but in this big open space. How did I know? What? Sir. Sir. I didn't sign up for that. I thought I killed all the Zambos down here. Fuck your head. You gotta stand right where I need to be, huh? There's gonna be a liquor in here. Instead of zombies. Oh, is he on the ceiling? Uh, really? scared the hell out of me. I thought there was just one liquor, but there were two. There were two, damn it. Didn't sign up for that shit. It's pretty high tech for a, for a police station. Yes, magnum bullets. Yes, handgun bullets. <laughs> More handgun bullets, thank Jesus. thing is sh oh actually no I should be okay because I gotta use the key one more time No, I have to use it two more times. Fuck. But I think all the zombies are dead, right? No, they're not. You know... This is rude. Like, why are there so many of you? Because right in here is more magnum bullets. Right? No? I lied? Oh, no there is. Wasn't there- 
Oh, what's in there? Okay. Also, where do I get the crank? Where the hell is the crank? I'm gonna go put stuff away. I can't even grab that herb. I know I gotta do the library puzzle and get one of the the things. Then I gotta do I gotta get the crank, get the cog, get the other one. I'm gonna put the key away for right now because there's probably some shit in uh, Chief Iron's office I can get. Then we'll go back and get the key because we gotta go downstairs and use it to get the cog. I like how he doesn't acknowledge this. He's like, alright, cool. Creepy office. I swear to god, if there's zombies in here, I'm gonna be a little pissed. Because I don't remember at all if there is or not. Oh, thank god. I think there's a first aid. Oh, the crank! I was just thinking about you. Oh, that's nice. Magic going out. What is this? <gasps> what? Oh, fuck. No. Not like this, really? Dude, that was so me. Oh, come on. I didn't remember that at all. Please. Please, sir. I'm, I'm just a young child. Leave me alone. My young child. I'm 21 in this game. To me, that's weird because I'm 25. So I'm actually the same age as Chris. Of, in 1998, so... Yeah. So... I actually... Should go downstairs, get the cog. Then go to the library. So I could do the puzzle. Get the other... thingy ma -bobber. And, uh... I need the key. Where's the key? Hmm. 
Yeah, that should be good. Okay. Alright, this device is way. But yeah, imagine going all irons. That would be creepy. Yeah, he's 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 kind of a creep. Ah, oh, my heart hurts. I do have to say, when I played Resident Evil 2 Remake the first time, I think it took me like over eight hours to do because Mr. X was just so fucking scary. Like, I would hide in the dark room and I'll be like, Haha, please go away. And then there was the liquors. The liquors were terrifying in that game. Like, holy shit. Like, I really don't know what was with, like, whoever did the design of the liquors in the remake. Oh, hi, Goliath. Um, the, because the liquors in Resident Evil 5 sucked. They're terrible. They're not really scary. And you get so much ammo in that damn game that it's not really much of a- Wait, what? Is this the Miranda rights? You have the right to remain silent. It can be used against you in the court law. You have a lawyer. If you cannot, you'll be pointed. Oh, that's, that's cool. I never noticed that. All right, who's ready for another heart attack? I don't even want to get that first aid spray, because that'll be too many heart attacks in one section, and we. I don't have time for that negativity in my life. God, he's such a dick. Oh, hi, Chris. We're just we're just having heart attacks over here. Oh, you know, should I grab? Should I make a run for it? Should I make a run for that first aid spray? No, I shouldn't. I can't be too ballsy. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna cry. Oh no, it's not coming out. Jesus. Don't punch me. Like, has did your mother ever teach you not to punch people? At least he doesn't chase you everywhere. Can you imagine how much more difficult this game would be if he actually did go everywhere at you? I would never play this game. I mean, it's already bad enough that Nem Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, the Nemesis kind of chases you periodically from section to section. And it's like, no thank you, please leave me alone. There's gonna be a liquor here now, isn't there? Yep. Yeah. Hi. No. Oh god. He's booking it. He's booking it! My feces! No, please! Is there going to be a liquor up here, too? Really hope not. Watch, I'm going to fuck up this puzzle. Just like I did during my Claire B for some reason. Okay, you know what? Fuck this game sometimes, I swear to god. 
Because I did that in my clear B, or I so I, so I thought. And, I don't know. I think I should get my shotgun out just in case, uh... There's a liquor up here. I don't think there is, because there wasn't in Claire B. But then again, there wasn't a liquor up here in Leon A. I don't hear anything. Okay. Still expecting the clock tower theme every time I come up here, but alas, it is only in edits. <gasps> this isn't me. Have you guys ever played Clock Tower on the PS1? It's Joe the Badger's favorite game of all time. He can tell you. Next time he streams and you guys happen to step by his stream, tell him that you know his favorite game is Clock Tower. Yeah, let's go. Let's just slide down the slide. Whee! No! Gasp. No, you haven't played it? It's okay if you know what you're doing, but when me and Joe the Badger tried playing it years ago, we used to have a co-op channel together. It's kind of dead, so we don't really use it anymore. But we played it and he is not a fan. And for what, from what I understand, ben. uh, cutscene, we'll, we'll talk about it in a minute. Do you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police. Co-conspirator. I like how the paper's still perfectly white. Mail to the Chief, blah blah blah. Albert Wesker, blah blah blah. William Birkin, blah blah blah. Dix. All right. Where are you going, Anna? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. I have a feeling hey, that's where you can be wait. disappointed. Hey. Is <laughs> it pristine condition? Yes, it is. No. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be all right, trust me. We found a way to pursue them. Follow us later. Claire! Claire! Wait, wait! Man, why doesn't anyone ever listen to me? Because you're Leon. A miserable death. Alright, do you have anything in here? Hmm. Anyway, as I was saying about Clock Tower, so the original Clock Tower game, the first one, it's technically the first one, was on the SNES only in Japan. And when they were, and the guy who created Clock Tower, he's like, oh, I didn't want to do a sequel. And they're like, yo, look at Resident Evil. That game is fantastic. Make a game. And he's like, okay. So Clock Tower 2 is on the PS1, but in America it's called Clock Tower one and then there was clock tower two the evil the struggle within on ps1 and then on the ps2 there's clock tower three 
Haunting Ground was a rejected version of Clock Tower 4. Just like how Devil May Cry is like a reject rejected version of Devil of Yeah, wait, Devil May Cry is a rejected version of like Resident Evil 4. One of them, anyway. That's why I always thought Fiona and Jill looked very similar. With the ponytail and blonde and blue eyes. Are the puppies gonna jump out at me? Please don't. I know there's herbs in there, but I don't want them. <gasps> Wait, did I grab the herbs in the one room? I didn't, and I don't want to go back. Don't touch me. Oh, Jesus. I hate spiders so goddamn much. What? Oh. Why couldn't we follow the butterflies? We're just gonna put these away for now because we're gonna... <laughs> doing a boss fight. I'm actually gonna save before I do this because I don't not in the best condition. And you know what survival horror game I've never played but a lot of people say that I should play but I don't really want to. Fatal Frame. I do not want to play the Fatal Frame series at all. I don't like the idea of the only way to kill the ghost is you take a picture and they'll just jump out in front of you. I don't like that. It's terrifying to me. Extremely. I've never played it. You never played it? I, I don't recommend it. N zero out of ten. Never again. I've seen like some let's play clips of it, but I'm like, yeah, this is not the game for me. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. <laughs> Yes, William, I know that, uh... Oh, I thought he was about to hit me. Please don't hit me. Oh, Jesus! He hit me. Get up! Leon! Dude! Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. No, 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 no. <laughs> what? I healed. I healed. I healed. I healed. I healed. That was not an instant death move. <clears throat> that was not an instant death move. I healed. See, that's why I saved. I fucking healed. That was a ripoff. It's like, I don't want to use the Magnum. Because that, the game, that's going to be important at the end game. Punches Boulder. Yeah. How do you highlight that? That's, that's kind of... I don't know, should I bring the Magnum and leave the shitty submachine gun? Since 
turning out like my Claire B. I have like no healing items. I fucking healed though. That was some bullshit. And I have like no healing items. So that's so that's cool. Hi Berkey. Yeah, I don't care. Oh ow. Get up, get up, get up. Really? I'm already in caution, huh? Yeah, just yeet yourself over, asshole. I didn't even need the magnum. Why did I even bring it? Ugh. What did I use, like, five shotgun shells on them? I don't even know. Or should I put the... Oh, we'll figure it out. I might have- might put the handgun away and just bring the submachine gun for a bit. How did you come from? What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got Ben. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together, okay? All right. We'll do this your way, Leon. All right. Now we got Ada. Go on, Ada. I like how she has, like... That, like... I don't know what I was trying to describe how her picture looked, but it's better than Sherry's. Sherry's picture is terrible. It just makes her look high as fuck. Hey, hey Ada, want to carry some herbs for me? Sweet, the save room. Oh my god, that was a lot of bullets at one time and I'm forever grateful. Ribbons. Ink ribbons.
Alright, Ada, I guess you stay here, because... I guess. I think I can get, uh, bullets down here. I think this is, like, a totally optional area to go in, but... I think it's pretty important. I like how I can actually see on the PS1. I could not see at all. I think that's it. Alright, we'll put the magnum bullets away because that's going to be helpful end game. Nice of you to join me. I actually think I'm gonna put that away for right now. I'm gonna need that too. 